I offer the Lannisters peace if they meet my terms. First, your family must release my sisters. Second, my father's bones must be returned to Winterfell. Third, Joffrey and the Queen Regent must renounce all claim to dominion of the North. These are... These are my terms. Rob's at a point where he knows that he's a king and he's really grown in confidence and he's his own man. He's proved to be a very capable leader, a very popular leader. Rob's one of the men, he's one of these soldiers and he's in it together with everyone. He's on the front lines with the men. He is so much part of them and he's proved himself. Five Lannisters dead for every one of ours. He seems a very good tactician in terms of how to win battles. He's made some decisions that have been questioned and most of the time he's been right and been very clever and I think that's what's gained the respect of the men. The king in the north. The consequences of every action are huge. You're fighting to overthrow a king and yet you have no plan for what comes after. First we have to win the war. He's constantly been fighting and, and wading through difficulties at every corner. There's so much weight to every order Rob gives. You've done so well. Your father would be proud. Although his father's dead, I think a lot of him still lives on in Rob. You have inherited your father's responsibilities. I'm afraid they come at a cost. Rob and his mother have been so close and been through so much. I'm the one rebelling against the throne. Before me, it was father. He married one rebel and mothered another. I mothered more than just rebels. But his relationship with his mother's starting to change quite dramatically. She can't tell him what to do. He has to make his own decisions. If I trade the Kingslayer for two girls, my bannermen will string me up by my feet. You want to leave Sansa in the Queen's hands? And are you? What are we fighting for if not for that? It's more complicated than that. You know it is. Rob's priorities are not only now to his sisters, to his brothers, to Winterfell, but very much so to a whole army that he's leading. 